Hello friends, welcome to BA Space Solution. My name is Lokesh Gandhi. In our today's session, we are going to discuss about load balancing feature in Oracle Fusion WMS Cloud. In Oracle Fusion WMS Cloud, we have one feature known as load balancing. With the help of this feature, we can spread the workload across the mirrored area of distribution center. This load balancing feature in WMS Cloud can be used with or without a material handling equipment system. In our last session, we have already seen what material handling equipment is and what are the different type of material equipment in our WMS Cloud. In WMS Cloud, the operation can determine the number of different zones to consider when running a wave by creating a groups. When WMS Cloud allow you to evenly spread the requirement from the wave across the different zone in the terms of number of order, units, and weight, depending on the most applicable matrix of the customer. Now let's see the concept of wave load balancing flow. In wave load balancing, the wave group has an order section and the capacity to create the balance wave. After creating the balance wave, WMS sends the wave pick information message to pick to light system. You can see in the flow diagram wave pick information being sent to the pick to light system. The pick to light system receive a wave pick information message. Now this system will perform the pick and packing operations. And when the pick operations are performed, the pick to light system will make an API call and send the pick confirmation through the API, you can see. And at the last, WMS upload the pick and pack information on our system. So this is the load balancing concept in WMS Cloud. So while creating the wave template, we can configure sending of picking and packing information in the material handling equipment. And at that time, we have an option, auto release pick information and auto release outbound LPN shipping information. We have to enable it by the clicking on the checkbox. So let's see how it possible. So let's switch to the instance. So this is our instance. Now let's search for the wave template. Wave template. Search. So let's click on create icon and we have to insert the template name that is active 007. And we have to define the allocation method that is first in first out. And we have defined the location mode that is pick from active. Wave search that is also pick from active. Right. And uh, we have two options that is auto release pick information and auto release outbound LPN shipping information. Right. When we select the first option and when the wave is run, then it automatically release the pick information. And in the same way, when we select the second option, then system will send the pack information if the wave is cubing in outbound LPN, right? So let's click on save. The template gets created, that is active 007 and select the record and click on run wave template. Please confirm, okay. So the wave completed, you can check the inquiry and for the run status, right? In this way, we can send the information to the material handling equipment, right? So this is how you can create a load balancing in WMS Cloud. So thanks for watching this video. Thank you so much.